The Empire's on the run. Infowars.com. Jones and the GC. Follow us on Twitter, Network. Real Alex Jones, PrisonPlanet.tv. The facts are in. The studies are legion. Sodium fluoride and other toxic members of the fluoride family are devastating the health and cognitive ability of the American people. So why are the social engineers adding it to the water? Simple. Dumb down the host population that the parasitic technocracy is feeding on. We may not have been able to get fluoride out of the water supply yet, but we can help to get it out of our bodies. I am extremely excited to announce the exclusive InfoWars Life Fluoride Shield Formula fusing six of the best documented ingredients from around the world to help the body remove not just toxic fluoride residues from the body, but a whole host of toxic substances. Let's take a stand against the globalist by blocking their poisons with fluoride shield. I use fluoride shield every day. Secure your fluoride shield and other pioneering formulations at InfoWarsLife.com today. Let's start cleansing our bodies now and support the InfoWar at the same time. That's InfoWarsLife.com. Hi folks, Alex Jones here with some important information. I want to tell you about Matt Redhawk and his team of patriots over at My Patriot Supply. Several years ago, Matt was sitting in his two-bedroom apartment, frustrated with the direction this country was headed, and the charlatans willing to sell us out for a quick buck. Deciding to take action, a company run by Patriots for Patriots was born. My Patriot Supply has never taken a loan or accepted outside funding. They now operate two distribution facilities and employ over 50 hardworking American men and women. It is rare to find companies who practice what they preach. And that's why I stock my pantry with high-quality storable foods from My Patriot Supply. Go to MyPatriotSupply.com forward slash Alex today for special offers on emergency food storage or call their preparedness specialist at 866-229-0927. That's 866-229-0927. Do business with someone who shares your values. MyPatriotSupply.com slash Alex. Alex Jones here with a message to fellow freedom lovers. The prognosis for the entire planetary economic system runs from bad to worse. The globalist model is to shut down societies and starve patriots out until they acquiesce to the global takeover. That's why we've assembled the most vital and important preparedness items at InfoWarsShop.com. These are items that I did research on, that I personally use. We've got the life straw, so you can turn fetid water into safe water anywhere you go. The KTOR hand crank generator to charge up key equipment during power outages or out in the field. Strategic relocation, third edition by Joel Skousen. When disaster strikes by Matthew Stein. Therosafe used by Homeland Security to protect yourself during any radiological event. Hand crank shortwave AM FM radios. Everything that we've researched and found to be the best is available at InfoWarsShop.com and your purchase makes our InfoWar possible. We're getting prepared. Are you? InfoWarsShop.com we are on the march. The Empire is on the run. Alex Jones and the GCN Radio Network. Yeah, we're living on the edge. Living on the edge of incredible human empowerment or absolute new dark age, the technotronic hellhole of Zbigniew Brzezinski and the New World Order. We're going right back to David Icke, and I'm going to try to shut up and give him the floor because uh, he's a busy guy, and it's hard to get him on. And I wanted to break down the perception, deception, his new book, uh, because we're all in this together. This is so serious. Briefly, everybody needs to be self-sufficient with gardens, buy local. The biggest thing you can do is go to MyPatriotSupply.com forward slash Alex. Non-GMO, organic, high-quality, storable food, what I choose for myself and my family the highest quality, the best sponsor that we could possibly get with storable food. We're very proud to have them. Top quality, top rated customer service. MyPatriotSupply.com forward slash Alex brought you this hour, 866-229-0927. You need to be self-sufficient, and this stuff lasts 25 years, so it's good to have it in case of an emergency. Also, it's all about not being disarmed. The globalists are doing everything they can to disarm the United States while they have an arms built up against us. And I get peace and not being offensive. I'm not an offensive guy. But the fact that we have guns is a real checkmate against their system. And the Molon Labe Greek 300 come and take it maxim that was then used again in Texas in 1836 when the Mexican government dictator came to take the guns. They said Molon Labe come and take it. We have put it out with the 
uh, Greek uh, Spartan helmet with two M4s crossed with the victory reef around it. It says Molon Labe, come and take it and under it, Info Wars. On the back, it has in the Greek letters, Info Wars. This is the way to spread the word, meet like minded people, and your purchase supports this broadcast. I think this is probably the most handsome t shirt we've ever put out. Now, we've got a gold foiled woman's shirt, women's shirt that gets here next week. It isn't up on the site yet. But that's, and it's formed, and oh, by the way, it's all made in America. I should have added that point uh, on th this for you. So I think, my God, this is going to be our best seller ever. Your purchases support this TV system, this radio system, the filmmaking, the news sites, the 48 p souls we got working on this operation. Our reporters in England, three of them. Our reporter in Washington State, the crew that's here. Uh, our auxiliary reporters, Prison Planet, dot tv the nightly news all of it so go to infowarsstore.com and get your molon lambe we've got a lot of the great come and take it shirts as well but this is the new made in 1776 molon lambe t-shirts uh and uh, they're the best i've ever seen because i love molon lambe shirts and so it took us months to come up with this design and it is available at infowarsstore.com or 888-253-3139 to get your molon lambe shirt it's an infowar they're bombarding us with their images. We bombard them with the truth, ladies and gentlemen, that we are seeing tyranny rising. All right, uh, listen, I'm going to give you the floor, or I'm going to keep jumping in here. David Icke, you were getting into the suppression of human consciousness. The fact is they want to, IQs are going down from the fluoride, Harvard study. We know they want to suppress us. They teach Common Core. You were talking about the state all over the world saying, your kids belong to us, two plus two equals five. They literally are like O'Brien in 1984 in the United States with Common Core. Two plus two equals five. A huge crime against the children screwing up their brains. What is at the bottom of the rabbit hole? Well, like I was saying before the break, um, the education system is crucial to the perception deception because you have young minds um, who can be molded um, day after day after day after day. And one of the great testaments to human consciousness in its greater form is the number of young people who've been through that system. So many uh, have, and, and it, it's, it's got them. But there's so many young people that have been through that system and have still seen um, the truth of what's going on. So that, that's in incredibly encouraging. So you've got education. Well, what passes for it? I mean, Gandhi once said, uh, or was asked what he thought of Western civilization, and he said, I think it would be a very good idea, and I think education would be a very good idea. That's not what we've got. It's a programming operation to turn young minds into little more than software programs that respond in the desired way to inputted data, i.e. situations that they face. But then... Going alongside that, the education system, parallel with it, of course, is the mainstream media, which uh, you and I have been challenging uh, for a long time. And the mainstream media is constantly supporting the version of self, the version of reality, the version of the world that education is pumping out. So now there are, if you like, stereo versions of this programming, uh, which uh, young people um, are receiving, and indeed people in general in terms of the media, are receiving all the time. And that is constantly telling them a version of events which simply isn't true, but if people buy it, their responses and their behavior will walk straight into the hands of the agenda for uh, global control. So the media is doing that. Then you have, um, and you've mentioned uh, one or two things, then you have the um, toxic assault on the human brain and the human genetic structure, for, uh, most notably through genetically modified food, which is there simply to genetically modify us. Then you, um, you have um, things like um, growth hormones, which are given to cattle, which then uh, cross over to humans. And so you have this big um, um, epidemic for that and other reasons of ob obesity, um, which, which, which again is um, taking people into a world that their bodies weren't meant to go into. I mean, just look back a few decades and see what it was like before. <laughs> and then you've got the, um, 
the aspartame. Then you've got the fluoride in the water, which are, are, are both brain suppressants and brain uh, rewirers. Um, and you put all this together, plus pharmaceutical drugs, plus the vaccines that are um, not only uh, deluging the human immune system in, in young children before it's even formed, it's also affecting people mentally and emotionally. That toxic, uh, the cocktail that, that, that uh, we call vaccines. So you put all this together and there's absolutely a war from multiple levels on human perception. And there's another one. And that is, you know, in the last 50 years, the radiation in our atmosphere at the level that we play out our lives has increased by millions of times. Some uh, open-minded scientists have called it um, an experiment on, on human life without knowing the outcome. But the people in the, in the core, in the shadows from which it is coming, they do know the outcome. And part of that outcome is to, and this is where we come into transhumanism, this is where we come into uh, the, the internet to a large extent, plus additions to the internet that are planned and indeed are now being talked about. I'll get to one of them in a second. Um, because the human brainwave um, activity operates at a certain frequency, frequency band. If you can access that frequency band with information delivered electromagnetically and electrically, then you are putting thoughts and perceptions and beliefs, um, perceptions of reality into that um, system. And the person is having thoughts and feelings and coming to conclusions that they think that are their own conclusions, but they're not. And anything that's got smart in front of it is part of that grid. Smart televisions, which can look at you. Smart um, uh, phones, uh, smart meters, smart grids. This is all part of it. And the idea is, I've been writing about this for years. Smart growth. Smart growth, smart cities, smart everything, smart smart cars. They call they call intelligent it highways. Yeah. So what's um? And of course, the word smart is to is to give the underlying subconscious as well as conscious impression that this is the smart thing to do. This is the intelligent way to do it. Uh, th there are benefits in this for you. No, there are not benefits for you. There is just control and suppression of your perception of reality and perception of the world. So you've got this. And for me, I've been writing about this for years. Um, you know, the internet has fantastic um, benefits for uh, getting this information out. I mean, you, me, and people like us would never have got the information out that we have uh, to the number of people we have without the internet. But again, if you're going to sell a prison, then you've got to sell it as a beneficial thing. And up to this point, it has been. But as you know, and, and, and people following the story know, the idea is, and it's already unfolding uh, in many, many different facets and faces, it's to take away the things that are beneficial uh, for the internet, for people, the free flow of information. That's right. They let it be free for a while, like a highway yeah. paid for by everybody's tax money. Then yeah. they hand it over to a toll road company. They're already starting with unified agenda worldwide to phase out the freedom. Exactly. And so what's left when they do that, if we allow it, is the beneficial part of the internet for them. And that is as a massive mind programming, perception programming operation. Spy grid. Be because... Um, for me, I mean, like I said, I've been saying this for years. What the internet is designed to be is a an electronic collective mind for humanity, and this is where the transhumanism comes in, because the idea of putting chips into people and other pieces of kit that connect us to the internet, um, and of course, Google at the forefront of all this stuff. Google's just a, just just a, the the smiling face of DARPA at that level, um, the uh, technological development arm of the Pentagon. That's why you have people like Regina Duggan, director of DARPA, moving to become an executive of Google. It's it's not brain science why that happened. They're expressions of each other, and and so the idea is to connect us to the internet technologically, so the internet 
becomes that collective. And let me throw this in. They're on record poisoning the environment and wrecking our genetics so that we've got to merge with the machine.